what's up guys my vernon kid here coming to you again welcome back to the opinion spot as always uh coming back with you guys with a top 10 list uh no i haven't done a top 10 list in a long time but uh as you can read the title uh top 10 must have games of 2012 yes i'm a gamer i'm, I'm proud of it <laughs> um now when i mean games of 2012 i mean games that are coming out now until the summertime not until next fall so you won't see any games from next fall so let's kick it off with number 10. number 10 is a game that kind of reminds me of gears of war in a way but since gears is over i need another first squad based game and that's sega's uh binary dom do domain um this game, like I said, is a squad-based game. You give your squads commands. Uh, it takes place in a far future. Um, it's created by the same man who created the Yakuza games. And as all, and as well, guys, I'm gonna put the uh, like trailers and gameplay in the the links so you can look at them if you want to check them out as well. Um, when I saw this trailer uh, at E3, I was like, okay, this is, I like this. This, is, this looks a lot based on Gears, but just a little differently. Uh, there's a thing called Consequence Mode, which I like. I like that in a factor as well. Um, that some of the things you do in this game, there are consequences. And I like games like that. I do like games that, you know, you make different choices, make the wrong choices, you make this kind of choices and it, it it can affect the game so I definitely love stuff like that um, it comes out this this uh, February actually uh, I think the 28th I believe uh, yeah so binary domain number nine uh, and everybody should know I'm this is I'm a big fan of this series I'm no slouch to this game and that's uh, Resident Evil uh, Operation Raccoon City uh, now yes I seen the trailer for Resident Evil 6 I cannot wait to that game but that's next fall uh, definitely but in the meantime yeah this would have to do for me for a Resident Evil game now this game actually takes place between 2 and 3 I believe uh, and you play with six different characters and in, in, in doing so also it's kind of the first time you're actually playing with the bad guys you're actually playing with the villains in this game you're playing with um, uh, umbrella agents in this game so is this is definitely going to be interesting to play um, but yeah I'm definitely looking forward to seeing how this game wraps up I did see gameplay of it and it looks like you, you'll be able to fight the tyrant and things like this in this game like I said it takes place between two and three so yeah um, I'm looking forward to it number nine I mean eight excuse me <laughs> number eight uh, is uh, another game I'm no slouch for and that's the new SSX now when the, we first saw the trailer for this they were calling this SSX Dark Descent like it, they, like it was like EA was going for a, a darker edge to the SSX franchise and I was like I don't know about that uh, but it looks like it's just back to being the old classic fun loving snowboard game with all the great characters from the series coming back um, hopefully a lot of the characters people who voice the characters celebrities and stuff who voice the characters in the previous games come back I've been playing SSX since she's tricky you know and I've always uh, SSX tricky and I, I, I love this series I, I love just the sheer over-the-top stuff you can do in this game and it's just a real fun game to play uh, this is another game that comes out this February as well um, most definitely looking forward to this game uh, very fun game indeed SSX number seven uh, like I said seven is another game that I'm looking forward to and uh, that's prototype 2 yes prototype 2 uh, is the next in the prototype series and 
in this game once again it's you know the free roaming game as well uh, the person you play with now is named is Sergeant James Heller and he is on a quest to destroy the black light virus that infected New York again uh, however he's also it's also a revenge piece as well because um, we find out that the main antagonist in the game is none other than Alex Mercer from the first game so Alex Mercer is the bad guy in this and Heller is after him for kind of causing all this so yeah it's, it's going to be different and interesting I've seen gameplay of this like they've added some new targeting systems and things like that to the game looks great um, a very very great open world game to be a uh, be playing and uh, I can't wait can't wait till this game comes out I think it comes out in March uh, number six last for 10 out of 6 and, and you should know this game guys and I'm talking about a shorter's wrap yes move over Kratos because there's a new badass in town and his name is Ashura and this guy is 100% badass uh, if you have not played the demo of this game play it get it download it it is so fun you'll get hooked on it um, long story short uh, my brother Malcolm I was gonna play it and he took it from me because I had to go to the bathroom or so and he was hooked on the game and right before like the game would say you know uh, you really get into the game and then all of a sudden to be continued and you're like ah it gets really good there it is basically a anime over the top just thug out game and uh, I can't wait uh, till this game comes out comes out February as well So there you have it guys, um, the first five in the list, uh, the top five will be next, uh, actually I'll give you it tomorrow, I'll be putting that up tomorrow, but I hope you guys enjoyed the list so far, um, I wonder, I'll try to guess what the top five games of 2012 for me must have games are for me and uh let's see um, but other than that i hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, i'd like to see your list uh if so um but other than that this is my kid peace